To keep it nice and clean Not freak out and cause a scene I try to hold it together Keep it together Not sure who I really am Just be cute and super bland I try to hold it together Keep it together Been playing it down But I'm so getting tired Now won't you meet Martin. Where's Martin? <laughs> <laughs> Love it. <sighs> You're funny. <laughs> Okay, so from Donelm, I got this little tree, which was £2.50. I got these three little wooden houses, which were £6 for all three. House! Because I got this in B&M, which is like a little nativity scene. House. Yeah, it's a house. This was £8. Um, they're just adorable, and I needed the little house to set the scene. Then from Dunelms, we also got these three uh, macrame, I think they're called, um, Christmas trees. They were £10. Then Martin got me these giraffe coasters. They say that they're £12.80, but on the receipt it actually said £16. Um, but Martin didn't want to go back, so... Yeah. Beautiful. And then we got this tray for the table um it's just got like little thingy majiggies underneath i don't know what they're called like little foam feet um for the middle of the table we've got some command hooks what else did we get got a light for the top of the stairs that was five pounds sorry darling <laughs> i got some um gift bags for the in-laws little thing that i do and some stickers for the kids presents managed to find some they'll have their own wrapping paper but obviously this is just to help us remember and little mimi wants to play with this so catch up with you later bella right i'm shutting the door you're not a diva you're not coming in the other door Oh, she's back at that door. She's actually an idiot. <coughs> Hello. <coughs> Hello. Good morning. <coughs> Good morning. Diva. <coughs>
That's what I've put. I said to them, I've put, got the bag and put them away for Christmas. Oh, they're all the different ones. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so cool. Isn't it? Yeah. But to be fair, you could always try them before Christmas because they're only like £2.25, I think. Yeah, but I think we know we like them, don't we? Yeah. I didn't make you a coffee. Sorry, I didn't realise you were. Oh, I don't think I'm gonna have milk. Oh, okay. I have a full bladder, but not milk or fuzzy. Okay. Good morning, Amelia. How are you? Are you okay? Did you have a nice sleep? Yeah. Good. So we had a lovely weekend. Good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> it is Monday. I didn't share much of our weekend away because I just didn't. I was enjoying some quality time with my husband. We had a lovely time. We managed to get quite a lot of Christmas shopping done. Again, I can't show you because the majority of it is for my son-in-laws and daughters. I know we're not going, we've got a budget. I'm sticking to the budget. So we're giving them some cash and then got them a few bits to open on Christmas day. Well, it'll actually, it possibly will be Boxing Day actually, because that's when we're seeing them all, we'll see. We went out for dinner with the lovely Karen and her husband, Adrian, and it was amazing. Absolutely amazing time. Love, 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 love catching up with her. Well needed, I needed it. We had a bit of a disaster at the hotel because the fire alarm. Well, first of all, I forgot my earplugs. Hi. Want to say hi? Okay. Say hi. Hi. Good girl. <laughs> you can have some breakfast. Okay. Yeah? Okay. Maybe we can have some breakfast. Yeah. yeah, so first of all, I forgot my earplugs, which was a disaster because I haven't slept without them for 20 years. So, yeah, that was fun. And then the fire alarm went off at about 10 to 1 in the morning. I looked out of the door to see what was going on because I weren't sure at first if it was just coming from our room because it was so loud. And then I realised they, they were evacuating everyone. But everyone was already dressed. So, well, the people that I saw walking past. So I think someone might have been smoking in the room because literally by the time Martin put some clothes on, it stopped so we just got straight back into bed again but then the, i managed to get some earplugs when we were out on the saturday and i slept very well so that was good i have put up all the christmas decorations come home and did that yesterday i'm not sure how good the quality of the video is going to be so i did film dum me putting dum. you want your dum dum i don't know where it is darling you have to ask mummy yeah i did film us putting up the tree but i because it was dark i'm not sure if the lighting i'll have a look at the video first and see see what that's like today um jj has an ultrasound appointment so but martin's had to go and have his tire fixed because he got a nail is that up there he got a nail in his tire oh it's a squirrel curled up in a ball it's like what is that fluffy thing on that tree yeah he got a nail in his tire on thursday i couldn't because he's got an electric vehicle they have to put special tires on they didn't have any in so blah 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 he's gone today i know i said blah 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 because it make the story any quicker <laughs> oh anyway so today i do need to do a bit of a food shop but i'm not sure if i'm i don't know which i don't know what i'm doing yet because i've got the kids we've got um ava indian zeke for the whole weekend because brit and brad are going to copenhagen for their wedding anniversary to christmas markets how fabulous so yeah we're having the kids so i'm i will need to have things in so it's gonna be a full-on week guys i don't know how much i'm gonna get filmed i don't know what kind of a weekly vlog this is gonna be it could just be what i have at the moment because yeah i don't know i just don't know bye. oh bye darling where are you going bella. you're going to see bella okay <laughs> i'm gonna stop waffling i'm gonna have my coffee and see how long martin's gonna be and then i possibly might have to go food shopping i might not i'm having my dining room table and chairs delivered tomorrow hopefully so martin and daniel need to get the old one out say hello get your finger out your nose that's disgusting <laughs> everyone can see you doing that no. they can <laughs> they can still say i'll show them <laughs> I'm only joking, darling. Right, I'm going to go have my coffee, put the TV on for the little lady. So, we got some new lights for the kitchen cabinets, and I really like them. Let me show you. I'll turn you around. 
I think it looks really cosy, obviously. I've got Christmas lights up. I feel like it's made such a difference. I love it! I'm so happy. Really happy. So hopefully, now when I'm actually showing you my dinners, it's not going to look pants. Well, it probably still will because it's to dinners and, <laughs> and not the lighting, but anyhow, we won't dwell on that. I'm going to crack on with dinner and I might check in with you guys again a bit later. Let me just show you how cosy everything looks. No, I won't go in the lounge yet because Mimi's playing, but I've got... I can't see anything. Look how cute it all looks. I'll show you upstairs. So I've got handbags on there, which is where they stay, obviously. Martin's coat at the top of the stairs. <laughs> and we've got a little bit of mistletoe. We'll go in there later. Santa's washing. <laughs> I've got my mugs there. So, you know, it's not time for all of this shenanigans but I'm excited and you only live once so there you go right anyway I'll catch up with you later yes I've just chopped up some peppers and onions got some salad we're gonna have these in some wraps with these bits and bobs but I'm just parboiling some um, wedges I went in the living room and I said um, to Jay and Martin do you want potato wedges or Mexican rice and Mimi went hmm wedges <laughs> okay so this is our meal plan for the week so we're having chicken wraps today we're having pie mash tomorrow we're having spaghetti bolognese on Wednesday Thursday we're having a chicken Kiev with jacket potatoes and I don't know what I'm doing Friday, Saturday or Sunday because we've got the kids. So that will be a working progress. We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh. Don't be discouraged anymore. You'll find thing you've been looking for you pick up the pieces of the floor just trust trust it'll be all right your heart is lonely but it's strong you might be lost now and it's not Discover the way even if it feels long Just trust, trust it be alright Oh, trust, trust it be alright Be still and know you're loved Be still Oh 
to have a bit of a clean up but the table and chairs are still not here they were supposed to be here today it's now 10 to 3 and on my delivery status it just says it's only just been dispatched so i'm not sure if it's actually going to be here today anyway i'll catch up with you if the table decides to show its face and even if it does it's probably not going to get done and i'm supposed to be having the kids all here for dinner tomorrow help day starts every single day because yeah good morning good morning you could probably do with some more food to be fair bells let me get some more food Was him when he died on the table. Oh look, there isn't one. There's nothing here. It's not been delivered. So now I don't have a table and chairs because obviously I was told it was being delivered yesterday. It hasn't been delivered, so that means that now we don't have a table and chairs. I have all the kids here for dinner tonight, which is going to be fabulous. It's out of my control. I literally, I'm, I can't physically do anything, but I'm angry. I, I really, really dislike when people commit to something and then let you down. Don't give me a date. Or give me a date that's realistic. If, you, if they'd have said the weekend, we would have kept the furniture here. <laughs> do you know what I mean? It's like, you can't win, can you? Anyhow, I'm going to have my coffee and check in with you after I've spoken to them and find out what's going on. Up, up, up in a painted cup I will pour my love from a cloud above So bright I can see the lights Taking you up and above the blue sky Tastes good to be drinking all of the honey sweet brew of ours Up, up in a painted cup Right in the sky like a firefly Like a firefly I believe to believe I believe to believe is to see how the present comes from dreams 
Up, up, up in a painted cup I will paraglide across the sky Let flowers and tiny hearts Shape in a line in the cup of ours So sweet like a honeybee Can buzz around a honey tree Up, up in a painted cup I Ride in the sky like a firefly mm, Like a firefly I believe to believe So what can I get for you? Oh yeah, can I have a, a gingerbread and cream latte, medium Small, please? Yeah, anything else? Yeah, and can I have, I'll have the roasted hazel latte as well, medium Any please. cream as well? Uh, yes please. Yeah, anything else for you? That's it, thank you. Hi! Hi! Bye -bye. We're going home. Say bye bye. Bye! We bye. will see you there when we are probably going to be asleep. <laughs> when they're asleep. They will see you when they're asleep, apparently. We love you, but remember, Jesus loves you yes, more. Yes, you are. And you are God's children. <laughs> Amen. Are you right, my love? I oh, okay. just need a coffee. Me too. Me too, Two Buster. Cream Thank you. And your Thank you very much. And you. Oh my gosh, there's an actual little bit of It's hot. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's groove to the beat. The funky, funky beat. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> she was having a nice little sleep. You looked so cozy. You're a funny little thing, aren't you? Oh, that was a big yawn. Hi! Hi! Hi. Are you in the prime of your cosy? We're going to go for a walk. We're going to go to shops. He's tired. Yeah. His eyes are already going, look. Yeah. Tired. You're tired? Yeah. Nate's tired, yeah. Right, let's go to shops. Just head into Sainsbury's again. Mimi's got a little bit of a rash on her bum. We're not sure if it's an allergy or if it's an happy rash. I'm going to go and see if we can get something from the pharmacy. And I need to get something for Zeke and Mimi for dinner tonight because we're having these chicken Kiev things and chicken potato and they don't want to eat that. So I'll bring you along again. I can't see because it's so bright. I was trying to get the effects. <laughs> I thought someone was laughing. <laughs> I thought someone was laughing at me. Like, oh, that's so funny. And Mimi just singing, <laughs> living our best life. <laughs> She's so cute. Cinder toffee profit rolls. We've got some festive bollabons. Korean style cauliflower popcorn. You've got some molten triple trees fondue, fondue bites. You've got some barbecue pork belly bites. You've got some mini beef burgers. That's some mini pie selections, naughty and nice chicken chunks. Some of them are black. There, some of them are black. I don't know if that looks very appealing, yeah. but like we've got some mini lamb shawarma flatbreads. Shawarma. I don't know what I'm saying. Don't ignore me. These look funky. Look at those. How pretty do they look? Done that one. You've got some Szechuan 
spiced chicken wing lollipops, some posh prawn toasties. You've got some crab and chili jam bayo bun sliders. They sound really nice. You've got some fish pie puffs and a king prawn selection. I'm definitely going to be trying some of this stuff out. What's happened? You've got something on your finger? Let me see. All better. Love you. <laughs> Love ya. Okay, so I just thought I'd quickly fill you in because I realised when I was editing a little bit of this week's weekly vlog that I haven't actually filled you in on what's happening with the uh, dining room furniture. So I contacted the actual delivery company and they were quite rude to be honest with you and just kind of said, well, it won't, you weren't given a date, which we were from the people we ordered it from. Anyway, so they've arranged delivery for next Tuesday which is really annoying but hey ho that's actually little Mimi's birthday as well which is... anyhow so it's coming next Tuesday so I haven't got it for this weekend so I rang um, the company they've kindly well, it's not quite... they've refunded me the delivery fee base basically so you know what else they can't really do anything else can they so at least that's a goodwill gesture I'm just doing some dinner. You'll see that on my Meals of the Week vlog. <laughs> I'm just doing... Um, I'll let you know what these are like. I'll write it on the screen or whatever. But the sun-dried tomato mozzarella chicken. Because it's supposed to be chicken Kiev's. And then I've got um, some jackets at the top of the oven there. And then I'm just going to chop up a bit of salad. Obviously not just an iceberg lettuce. <laughs> not just an iceberg like this. I think I've got actually I think I've only got some onion and cucumber it will do we're not as ma massively starving to be honest with you so but there you go so yeah we just dropped seat home he had dinner um the kids did really well with their dinner they ate it all they loved it they had a uh, chicken tikka masala and a basmati rice they loved it they did really well and then we will be picking up the kids tomorrow from school and they're staying until we we'll take them home Sunday and put them to bed and everything and then wait there for Brit and Brad but Brit and Brad are going to Copenhagen so I hope they have an amazing time make some wonderful wonderful memories because they deserve it they work so so hard and we will have a crazy crazy weekend but I'm thoroughly thoroughly looking forward to it but I hope that everyone is okay and I just want to say from the bottom of my heart that you are all so wonderful and your wonderful kind messages always on every single video that I put out even if it's whatever just you are so kind and supportive and I cannot tell you what difference it makes in this wicked wicked world with miserable horrible people in it to have that bit of light over on this channel is just amazing and i appreciate each and every one of you so please let me know how you're all doing because i just love getting to know you all and hearing about your family and things like that i love it if you're having a bad time share reach out my email's linked below so honestly i might not get back to you immediately because my life is a bit crazy but i will always endeavor to get back to you and I will keep you all in my prayers as always. I love you guys so much. I really do. Honestly, I can't tell you what I can't express what you what you all mean to me. Um, so thank you for being in my life. And I'll catch up with you in the next video. Lots and lots and lots of love. God bless. I feel so free. Oh my sweet baby.